One of the most requested features on the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera is the ability to have a flip up screen. Well, what if I told you you can go from this to this? Stay tuned. What's going on guys? Welcome to Flash Film Academy. My name is Todd Turner. And if this is your first time watching this channel, this channel was designed to help people like yourself turn their passion into profit. We call them contentpreneurs. All right, guys, let's get right to it. So after doing some research, after doing some long, hard research on how to achieve this, I finally found it. A way to add a flip up screen directly to your Blackmagic Pocket Cinema camera. Now, there is a little bit of a catch to it. There is a little bit of work involved and the price is around $300. I found uh, some manufacturers in China that will add a flip up screen to the back of your Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 4K. Now, there are some details to it. I had to do some digging, some searching, and I, found it. However, there are some things you need to know before you decide to go this route, both good and bad. So I found a manufacturer on a site called Tobio. It's more of a Chinese eBay or Alibaba, and they do custom flip up screens for the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera. Now, it's actually not that expensive. It's around 300 bucks, but you have to send your camera to them. And you know, like I know, that shipping to China is not the fastest thing in the world, but they claim that they can have it done within three business days and shipped back to you. So they claim that this modification is not destructive and does not damage the camera in any way at all. In fact, you can go back to a stock setting if needed. The thickness of the screen is only seven millimeters, so it's pretty thin, even though in the picture it looks like it protrudes a lot. You still can use a lot of the cages um, and accessories you currently have with this modification. It uses the original LCD screen that's on the back of the Blackmagic, so you don't have to worry about getting a cheap screen that doesn't look good or the touch screen not working. It uses the original screen on the back of it so you know you still have that great screen that Blackmagic provides and all your touch functionality still work. However, there's an asterisk. Because Blackmagic didn't design this and it's not a part of their software, when the screen flips up, it will not rotate. You're going to have an upside down image. This vendor also planned to release a sun hood, which will come sometime around or after June 15th 2019. The manufacturer claims that the hinges and everything is very rugged. It offers a lot of viewing angles. In fact, they offer a lifetime warranty on all labor and parts involved with this modification. Now that may mean you may have to send it back to China. And I don't know if you want to be without your camera for three, four, six weeks for this modification. However, to some of you, this is the greatest thing since sliced bread, and my job is to make sure I provide it to you so you can have that option. Now, what's also neat about this particular modification is it allows you to also have a solid state drive installed where the screen used to be. Now, there's a special particular type of solid state that they use. However, the chips that fit inside the enclosure can be purchased anywhere on Amazon. It's a pretty common size solid state drives. The ones that are, are typically used in the MacBook Pro is now the more skinny long ones. So just like that, you can have a terabyte of memory on your camera with a flip up screen and you're still handheld without a cage and you're out and about filming. It would have been nice if the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera had this design initially, but hey, for $299 more, you can get it installed on your camera. Now, a few things is the modder claims that he gives you a lifetime warranty on all of the parts, no matter how they're damaged, why they're damaged, whatever happens, especially with the yellow cable, he will provide 
um, a replacement for it or will replace it free of charge, no questions asked. So from what they're saying, they really stand behind this modification. You know, there are carbon fiber parts used, though to me it kind of looked like a sticker, but kind of looked like vinyl. However, the page states that they use carbon fiber parts to keep the price down. Now listen, this mod is not for me. I don't care that much about a flip up screen to send my camera to China in hopes that I get it back. That's just me personally speaking. I'm okay with slapping a monitor on it. It's a cinema camera. It's not a mirrorless camera. Therefore, I don't care about a flip up screen. I care that I can attach a monitor on it. So a full size HDMI is more important to me. I don't personally know this company. I've never had experience with them. I just came across this and I know I have a lot of subscribers that love this camera and they asked for this feature and I wanted to provide the information over to you. The link is in the description. You have to sign up for the site, sort of like eBay, to go with the purchase. And the modder or seller of this mod seems to be a pretty reputable guy based on his ratings on the website. But let me make it clear, I don't know these people. Don't know these people. I just came across this and thought that this would be a great thing to share to you guys because there are some of you who really, 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 really wish this thing had a flip up screen. And this particular modification is pretty dope. I'm not gonna lie. If this was my thing and I really needed it for $2.99, it's a no brainer, I'd go for it. And the fact that it uses the built-in screen and not some cheap flimsy knockoff screen that's gonna be faded or won't have accurate colors or things like that, that's a goal for me. It's, it's definitely a goal for me. However, However, I'm not about the life uh, of sending my camera to China and hoping I get it back. I'm cool, bro. That's, that's not going to happen with me. Hey, if one of you guys do it and you like it, please post in the comments. Send me some pictures. I would be more than happy to uh, maybe do an interview or talk about your experience going this route. I just want to provide the information to you guys who are diehard flip up screeners. You know, it's, it's a few of you out there that are some diehard screen flippers and it's cool. You, you want to vlog with the camera and all that stuff. That's cool. I get it. But I wanted to make sure that you had this information. Listen, if you learn anything from this video, anything, if you learned about a new website in China that sells stuff that you may not be able to get in America, if you learned about anything, please make sure you hit that thumbs up button. And if you haven't subscribed, please do so. And I will see you guys in the next video. If you like this video, hit the subscribe button and let's get it. Perfect.